Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today guys we're going to take a look at a gorgeous 1967 Chevrolet Chevelle True 138 Super Sport car guys. Great car. I actually sold this car about eight years ago to a gentleman here locally. Um, when I bought it, it was about a 10 year old uh, rotisserie restoration, complete frame off, it's body color underneath. Great car, man. Big block, four speed, blinker tack, super cool car, man. I apologize right now, guys. You can see the leaves everywhere, the wind's blowing, there's there's just nothing we can do, man. It's a little it just it just keeps blowing everything everywhere. Uh, but great car. Uh, car's got somewhere around 60,000 original miles on the car. Uh, there's about 3,000 miles on this restoration. Uh, like I say, about 10 years ago it was done. Uh, so you can kind of nitpick some stuff as you walk around the car. But very nice car. And again, original 138 Super Sports. Uh, all body color underneath. Really good looking car, man. Good looking car. There's a couple of stone packs. You can see some things that could be touched up on it. But nice car. And of course, these 67s are tough to get your hands on. Chrome's nice. Stainless is nice. A uh, couple cool options with that four speed tilt wheel, blinker tack. And sorry about the dust guys it just all of a sudden the wind kicks up and leaves are everywhere it's just got a new front windshield in it Good looking car. Bunch of new stuff coming, guys. I just got back actually from Mississippi buying cars. I got a bunch of new stuff that's actually already here. Um, I know guys are anxiously awaiting videos and pictures. Try to get that stuff dust done just as soon as I can. Car's nice and flat down the sides. Brand new 18 and 20 inch uh, American Racing uh, torque thrust all the way around it. Brand new rubber. Good looking car, man. And again, we got it up on the hoist. Got some nice pictures of the underside for you. They have converted it to front disc brakes. Not a matching numbers car. It is original big block car, 138 car. This is a uh, three. It is a 396 era correct motor. Um, Muncie four speed. Uh, dual feed four barrel. It's got the. Uh, you can see it's got the Wien aluminum intake on it. Chrome air cleaner, chrome valve covers, power steering, <laughs> uh, power front disc brakes, HEI distributor. It is a Muncie four-speed manual trans. Black pinstripes tape on it. If you don't like it, it comes off. I like it personally. I love pinstripes on these cars. Good looking car, man. E pillar chrome's nice. It's 
got the black vinyl interior. Sorry, it has a little dust in there. Like I say, man, it's just been whipping around here. The guy's been waiting for me to do this. And, uh, bucket seats, council, uh, really nice. Got the tilt sport wheel in it, her shifter. Like I said, Muncie four speed manual trans. Headliner's nice. Uh, blinker tack, and yes, it does work. 65,885. That is supposed to be the original miles on the car. Got some aftermarket Stuart Warner gauges underneath there. Uh, AM, FM, cassette, radio. I, I couldn't get it to work, guys. I know the blower motor works. H pipe, Flowmaster dual exhaust, 12 bolt, 355, limited slip rear end. Sorry, we got dust everywhere, guys. Does have a VF Goodrich spare in the trunk. It's all spackle coated, trunk solid. And got it up in the air for you. Got some good pictures of the bottom. Bottom of the car, the floorboards are all body color. Car drives out good. I'd probably put, I'm gonna say eight, 10 miles on it. Good car, nice and tight. Plenty of power. Uh, it's not, you know, doesn't really squeak or rattle. The only thing I really noticed is a little belt noise maybe coming off the alternator, but that's about it, man. Good tight car, parking brake works. Seats are nice, they've definitely been all repadded. Council's in good shape. Dash pad looks good. The gauges are nice and clear in here. No on the clock, guys. Council looks good. A little kidding on those door handles. That A-pillar cone looks great, man. Really nice. See how Nathan does with the four-speed here. This is my son Nathan doing his first video. Nice little cam to it. Runs on pump gas. Good sound of big block. Like I say, just a little cam to it. Nothing crazy. That car's got a good look to it, man. Sits good. Again, blinker tack works. Give it a little rev there. And also the uh, the blinker does work in it, which is pretty cool. Fuel gauge works. Uh, gauges down there are all functional. Like I say, I know the, the radio is the only thing that I couldn't really get to work. Blower motor is working. Brake lights work. Left turn signal. Right turn signal, no on the backup lights, they weren't working. Give a little rev, Nathan. Good sound, a big block, guys. Again, radio, the clock's on, but I couldn't get the radio to come on. The blower motor does work. Gauges are all working down there. Doors open and close, nice. Wipers, they work. Headlights. Put your headlights up. Yeah. Hit your bright switch on the floor. There you go. Yep. Left turn signal, right turn signal. Hit your horn. Yeah, and make sure you keep track of our inventory, guys. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Another great way to keep in touch with us is through our uh, Instagram or our Facebook page or our YouTube page. Or as always, guys, the old-fashioned way, pick up the phone, give us a call, 248-620-3355.
car's got a good look, man. Good looking car. Not so good with a four-speed. <laughs> Have a great day, guys.